What's up YouTube, my name's Will, and in today's video I'm going to be going through both the technique and a couple of progressions for the straight bar dip. So guys, what we're going through today, as I just said, is the straight bar dip. Now, the reason I'm doing this is because I want to make a video on one of the key things that help me get the muscle up, and you're going to need to be able to at least do the negative portion of this in order to be able to do it. So I'm going to do a tutorial for the straight bar dip first. This is basically just a dip variation where you only need one bar instead of two, as you'll see in a moment and essentially you're going to be working a little bit more your chest um, you're going to be getting triceps as well obviously as it is a dip motion uh, but it is primarily working the chest so first of all let's get into the technique okay so the first thing you want to do is get yourself positioned over the bar hands about shoulder width apart and get yourself supported with your feet off the ground the main point for this is that you want to push your shoulder blades down so they want to be depressed now from this position we're going to bend the elbows keeping them nice and tight to the body until your chest hits the bar. You'll notice that my legs have come forward and you'll also notice that my head and chest has come forward and that is to keep the centre of gravity in the right place so we're able to balance throughout the rep and then simply push back up and straighten back up to that top position with your shoulders depressed. So remember pushed down, shoulder blades down. Now I'm just going to do a couple of example reps here uh, nice and controlled you don't have to do anything too crazy with the speed the slower the better increased time under tension builds more muscle and just remember to focus on those key points head and chest going forward feet and legs going forward and keeping your scapula in the right place keeping the elbows tucked into the body and that is the straight bar dip Okay, so that was the technique done. Now we're gonna get into a couple of progressions. So the first progression that I would advise that you do if you've never done a straight bar dip before is simply to get yourself in that first position, raise yourself up until your tippy toes, and then take your toes off the floor and balance in this supported hold position, focusing on keeping your shoulders down on depressing the scapula, because this is actually quite a challenging thing for some people if you're not used to it. So that's the first thing I would advise you to do. The second would be to do the negative portion of the movement, so just the lowering down phase. So the technique is exactly the same as I showed you at the beginning, except we're just going to do the negative phase and then stop, put your feet down, walk back up and get into that top position and do the first half of the rep again. This is important because it builds strength in the movement pattern that you want to eventually achieve the pushing motion for, and most strength is actually built during the negative portion. So if you can't do the pushing phase yet, then just do the negatives. Your body will get used to the movement and eventually you will be able to develop the strength to push back up. Okay guys, so that was my complete tutorial on the straight bar dip. If you have any questions at all, if I think I left anything out, then let me know in the comments. I'm always replying to people who are asking questions down there. If you did enjoy the video and it did help you learn this move, then make sure to drop it a like, it really helps out the channel. If you haven't done so already, make sure you go down there, click the subscribe button and make sure you ding on the notification bell so you get notified every single time I upload. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.